Here's another member to my pet household. It's my big fat cat, Josie, and I'm trying to coax her out. She kind of does, as most cats do, she does her own thing and kind of um, works on her own schedule. But if I can get her to come up on the bed, I've got something I'm going to try with her. I'm a little hesitant because it's one of these as seen on TV products. It's called the Shed Monster. It looks like they promote it for dogs, but my dog doesn't shed because she's a poodle. So, oh, I hear some meows. So I'm going to give it a try. It looks a little vicious, but she doesn't mind getting her hair groomed. So I'm going to give it a try. Hi, Josie. Come here, baby. Look what Mommy has. We're going to groom you. Oh, yeah. Do you like that? Yeah. Josie tends to shed and shed and shed. Hmm. Do you like that? So you don't mind it, do you? I'm just waiting to see if it takes off a lot of hair. Oh, what a pretty girl. Does that feel good? I don't know. I don't see a lot of hair on the bristles. So here's what I can tell you. Um, I've been brushing her for a few minutes now and I'm not actually getting any hair on the shed monster itself but it does seem like if you go over the same area several times that it really starts to penetrate deep down in to get some of the hair out. Um, but what I'm also finding is that it's leaving it on my bed. How does Josie feel about it? Josie, what do you think? Appears to be fine by her. The next product I have for Josie is a window mounted cat bed that installs in seconds. But Josie does love to sit in the sun. Um, will the suction cups hold? I don't know. She is a pretty fat cat, although on the cover of this it shows a pile of bricks and says it holds up to an amazing 50 pounds. And I know she's not 50 pounds yet. Um, I'm going to put it up and just see how she is, how easy it is to put up, and if she'll actually sit in it. Whether or not she'll use it will remain to be seen. Some assembly required, but no tools needed. I've got the cat bed installed, and a um, couple flaws with this design here. Uh, first of all, I'm okay with it structurally in terms of the principle. It's kind of like a suspension bridge, and I know that these suction cups can have pretty good suction. Um, the major problem is, see if you can figure it out, it's not that I hung it crooked, it's that it is not, or rather, it is too wide for my bedroom windows. I live in a pretty modern house, so... Um, I would think that this is not an abnormal window width, so something to think about. I would feel totally fine with it, and I like that it doesn't um, leave any damage or anything like that on your window sills or anything like that. But otherwise, size-wise, um, I'm going to have to give this one a thumbs down.